build your hours moody quake to play and what's up everyone and welcome back to another youtube video with your host ken kukin and today we're going to talk about should you sprint or should you not now this is a broad topic i see people that sprint around and they sprint into bullets i sprint into bullets you sprint into bullets the enemy sprint into bullets but here's here's a quick here's a quick um tip on how to try and avoid sprinting into bullets so let's say you're in the spawn and you're coming out of the spawn um a good rule of thumb that i take is once you get to 50 percent once you have crossed 50 percent of the map or you can get close to the 50 percent mark of the map right the middle of the map where you're going to engage the enemy team you probably want to stop sprinting so here's a here's a short example here i spawn up boom i'm running one you know so here we go i'm going to run towards the center of the map now this is part of the center right and I'm going to stop here. Now I have a couple of options. I could sprint, right? And I could run across. And I just played a game with a teammate that I came here and I stopped. Because a lot of enemies, they'll jump on the cube or they'll jump on the ledge or they'll float across, jump across. They're looking, hey, who's this on the radar across the map? And they're looking at me, right? And then I had the teammate jump up here and go, do, 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 pow, 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 get shot, 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 shot. And then he like runs into the wall to take cover and then ends up dying anyway. And, you know, and then we get pinched because he's weak and the enemy's like, hey, he's weak. And then I had a guy AFK that I didn't know about. And so I'm watching my teammate like, all right, I'm going to cover him if they jump up. And then I get shot from the side. I'm like, all right, well, that sucked. So when you're sprinting, you want to go to about halfway to the map, right? So this gives me good cover, but you could also say, all right, boom, I can stop right here. If anyone jumps on the cube, if I have a longer range weapon, scout rifle, sniper, pow, shoot him. Anyone jumps up, pow, shoot him, you know. You're in cover from here until they, you know, kind of walk to about that pillar. Um, They have to walk pretty far out to the right. You're in cover from there. And you're still, you know, relatively effective at looking at the middle. So, at least out of the spawn. Now, when you're spawning up, you're going to want to run around and kind of gauge and guess where the enemy is. But when you're coming out of the spawn, remember the enemy team's doing the same thing. So, every map you can divide in half and... This map you can actually divide and it's pretty symmetrical this is where i would take the line oh look we have a little indicator right here boom here's the starting point the line would go straight this way it would go straight this way it would cut up you know invisible line through the wall right where it's going to go through heavy or through overtime this is you know competitive all the way up here here's where heavy would be and it would cut through there and now you've cut the map in half so this is the center area of the map so to speak like right around here but <clears throat> once you get to, to that half wave line, it takes everyone about the same time to get there. If we, if me and an enemy were to come out here, we would, we would get here around relatively the same time. We'd probably already see each other on the radar by now, and he'd, he'd be cutting that corner, or maybe he'd be on top of the platform, and I would be just out here exposed in the open like an idiot. But you know, this is the angle I decided to choose, and maybe you're confident in your shot, and hopefully it pays off. So. Long story short, guys, when you're sprinting around the map, remember someone could be crouched down over the radar. They could be sitting right over here, waiting for your big guardian head to come right over the corner, and pow. The first thing they see is your head, so they're already getting a crit shot on you if they hit you, right? So, anyway, hopefully this helps. Take that to heart. Try to employ it in your games when you're starting out of the spawn. And I'll catch you all next time. Hit that subscribe. Leave a thumbs up if you got any comments, questions. Any other topics you'd like me to cover, let me know in the comment section below, and we'll see you soon. Enjoy the rest of your day.